the mound for the Marlins is Jesus Luzardo. This will be his eighth start of the season, coming off his first win of the season Friday night against the Mets. Just one walk. Monasterio three for six in the series had a home run on Monday night. In the air toward right. And it is Jesus Sanchez to put it away. One of the most productive hitters in the National League this year. Great numbers, 335 average, 940 OPS. And he fooled him again that time on the slider. So the first strikeout here tonight. Yelich had the two run triple last night. That was the big swing in the game. Now the 0 2 is swung on and missed strike three. He got him with a slider. Two strikeouts and a perfect top of the first inning for Jesus Lazardo. The ace, Freddy Peralta, trying to get back on track. Last three starts against the slider. Batters are hitting 389. Look for that to be a factor. Jazz Chisholm Jr. leads off against him here in the bottom of the first. And Jazz sends one out to right and clears the wall. Lead off home run for Jazz. Well, 3 1 count. Jazz took advantage of it. Peralta was unable to command that fastball. And number seven on the year for Jazz. His second leadoff home run of the season. Chisholm gives the Marlins a 1 0 lead. The production continues out of the top spot for Jazz. He had a swing and a miss. Took a little extra off, and De La Cruz is gone on strikes. Check swing. Did he go? He did. And Freddie Peralta climbs the ladder with that fastball on Bell. Picks up his second K. He's used Sanchez starting for the second time. Hits it in the air to right. In the ballpark for Jackson Churio. Makes the catch, and after the leadoff homer by Jazz Chisholm, Freddie retires the Marlins in order. Lazardo's one-two pitch, and that is... A little bleeder into center. That's going to drop in there for a base hit. So Adamas with two hits last night. A leadoff single here in the second inning. 0-2 to Sanchez. And line drive back up the middle. So a two-strike base hit for Sanchez. Two on and one away for Jackson Churio. Check and he went around. Another strikeout for Luzardo. Owen Miller, first baseman for Milwaukee. Couple of hits in the series. Two for five. Runners go and Berger... Did not get there in time. They uh, may take a peek at this. This is a very risky play by Adamas. It just makes zero sense with two outs. So your base hit, you're scoring anyway. Well, even when Adamas. After the call is overturned, the okay. runner is out. Miami will retain their challenge. <laughs> Freddie Peralta looking to bounce back. He started this road trip Friday night in Houston. Gave up five runs in five innings. 3-2, a swing and a miss at that slider. And it ends a nine pitch at bat with Jake Berger. Third strikeout for Freddie Peralta. The 1 1. And a ground ball to third. Charging it as Ortiz. Plays it on the forehand. Plenty of time to fire across and take care of Anderson. It's a 1 2 3 inning for Freddie Peralta. He has sat down six in a row. It's quickly nothing and two on Monasterio, who flew out to right field back in the first. Cap pulled down right to his eyeballs. The 0 2 pitch rolled over to shortstop. Anderson off balance. Throw to first in time, and the inning is over. Jesus Lazardo, a big Florida Panthers fan, has a ball game to catch and a hockey game to watch in an hour and 15 minutes. He's flying. Seventh career leadoff homer for Chisholm. Starting to get his groove back offensively. 2-2. Two -two. And it's held on to by Contreras. Another strikeout for Freddie. Nine in a row set down. He's got four Ks through three innings. He can still have high strikeout rates and low pitch counts. Contreras lifts one out toward left field. Gordon in front of the track makes the catch. One away. Goes with the fastball. Two outs here in the fourth inning, and the batter is Willie Adamas. Maybe right. This one out toward left field. Looks playable for Nick Gordon. Well, Jesus Lazardo has really settled down. He's retired seven Brewers in a row. Ten in a row retired here by Peralta. Both starters have settled in. He was one of Freddie's four strikeout victims earlier. Sharply hit and a base hit for Josh Bell. Takes one outside, a four-pitch walk, and the Marlins have a couple men on here in the fourth inning. After the one-out single by Josh Bell has placed the Marlins at first and second with one away for Jake Berger. And he struck him out looking right down the middle at 98. Berger must have been looking for something else. And out of way of getting through this mess for Freddie. Rolled to first base. Owen Miller has it, steps on the bag, and Freddie Peralta strands a pair of Marlins. It's a leadoff base knock for Tim Anderson, who had a base knock in his return from the injured list last night. Up high, throw to first, and they've got Anderson picked off. Miller throws the second. 
And a great play by William Contreras to get the out on Tim Anderson. Perfect back pick, and Anderson caught in no man's land. Now 2-2 two, two, and two outs, and of course Fortes drops a base hit right center field. How big was that pickoff? So Jazz Chisholm is third time through. This is where Freddie has really ran into some problems, especially lately, that third time through the order. Rolled towards first, backhanded play, Miller. Bobble, Peralta. Got him just in time at first base to get out of the inning. One out here in the sixth inning. Blake Perkins squares to bunt, and Fortes makes the play. Great job, Nick Fortes, out of the crouch to snag the popped up bunt. In the air toward right field, Sanchez gets underneath it and puts it away. Trying to go clean for the first time since the third inning. Seven whiffs on the changeup today for Freddy Peralta. Got him. High heater. Six strong innings from Freddy Peralta. That's his sixth strikeout. And Jesus Lozardo getting it done tonight. He's retired 13 consecutive Brewers, and he's doing so efficiently. This is Contreras out to left, playable for Gordon. He's done a great job of working that strike zone. Left field again for Gordon. He's retired 15 batters in a row. And there's a line drive picked off by Berger at third. Jesus Lazardo has been perfect since the third. Freddie Peralta leadoff homer by Jazz Chisholm. It's the only scoring in the game. Solo shot to lead off the bottom of the first. A chopper to third. And a wide throw scooped up by Owen Miller for out number one. This play by Miller to save Joey Ortiz of a throwing error. And he locked him up. Threw a change up right down the middle. And Gordon caught looking. Seventh strikeout for Freddie Peralta. Fly ball to center. Blake Perkins is there, makes the catch, and that's seven quality innings from Freddy Peralta tonight. Welcome back. Jesus Luzardo is still dealing. Into right, long run Sanchez will make the play, and that is matching a career best. 17 in a row retired for Jesus Luzardo. It also matches the seven and the third, the longest outing of his career. Well, you're going to find out right now as Sanchez gets base hit to left, snaps a stretch of 17 consecutive batters retired, and we're going to see a pinch runner for Sanchez. Ground ball to Anderson. Flips to Lopez. Double clutch. Cost the double play. Just didn't have a good grip on it. 65th stolen base of the year for the Brewers, third most in the big leagues. Man in scoring position. That is rare. Just the second time of the game for the Brewers. Three and two. Popped him up. Otto Lopez on the outfield grass gives way to Sanchez. Jesus Lazardo, a career high, eight shutout innings here at Lone Depot Park tonight. Here is Tanner Scott trying to finish off what was a great start from Jesus Luzardo. Got him. That's the slider. One away here in the ninth. Out towards center, Jazz going back. Looks like he's got room to put it away. Two down. Tanner Scott will be tested against one of the National League's best hitters. Ground ball right side. Berger can't field it. A race to the bag. Contreras wins the race. The game continues. Tough play for Berger. Went underneath his glove. And then Lopez feeding Tanner Scott. But Contreras sniffing a base hit all the way. Yelich two strikeouts and a fly out against Luzardo tonight. One for four, three strikeouts. Lifetime against Tanner Scott. And that is to Anderson. It's a Marlins win. The Marlins toss their fourth shutout of the season. Uh, this has been outstanding. An hour and 54 minutes. The Marlins have won three consecutive series.